we're off to explore the northern plains of St. Carlos. This part of Costa Rica is known for its rich agriculture. We pass by large fields of pineapple and sugarcane, but not every crop here is grown on a large scale. This area, you know, the, the most likely to see is small farms and people are so self-sufficient, you know, like um, difference between here and the cities, you know, like uh, in this kind of climate, anything goes. They would have pigs and, and all their animals, they would have a main crop, you know, for the rest of the property. You moved from the city out here. What is it like? How is it different? Oh, you know, we love it, you know, and we just wanted to get out of the noise and the, the fast life and what a better place to do it than this. You get back in time, you know, you get so natural and so primitive in a way, you know, that it allows you to enjoy the, the good things, the simple things in life. It's very tropical down here. Where there is water, there is life, and this area is famous for the irrigation. You know, there are so many rivers crossing these uh, plains, you know, like that it's unbelievable. We head to the Platinar River to let our horses cool off a bit. Whoa! Now it's getting deep! <laughs> <laughs> there you go! <laughs> Horses are cooled off now. <laughs> For a hot day, this is the way we turn off the air conditioning. <laughs> For more travel video clips, expert tips, and to learn more about Equitrekking on PBS, visit our website at equitrekking.com.